please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click on that like button if you like my video. Also click on that notification bell. Thank you. In this video, we are going to cover the benefits of Linux. Linux has gained widespread adoption in various sectors, from personal computers to servers, mobile devices, and embedded systems. Let's go over some of the primary benefits that Linux has to offer. Number one is open source. Linux is open source software, which means its source code is freely available to anyone. This allows everyone to view, modify, and distribute this operating system. Then we have cost effective. Linux is generally free, though some enterprise distribution might have associated cost for support and additional features. Those operating systems are such as like a Red Hat operating system or SUSE Linux. This makes it an attractive option for both individuals and businesses wanting to reduce software licensing cost. Then the next one is security. Linux has a strong security architecture. Its permission and authentication model offers a robust layer of system protection. The open source nature allows for rapid detection and patching of all vulnerabilities as well. So, of course, when it, you know the code, you could change the code, and when you find out those vulnerabilities, you could secure them right away. Then the next one is stability and reliability. Linux systems are known for their stability and can run for years without needing a reboot. Crashes in one application generally don't affect the whole system because one Linux system can actually support multiple applications that can run simultaneously. Then the next one is flexibility. Linux is highly configurable. Users can add, modify, or replace any part of the operating system for their specific needs. This makes it suitable for a wide range of devices and use cases from supercomputers to IoT devices. Then the next one is software repositories. Most Linux distributions have vast software repositories, which allow users to easily search, install, and update required software packages. Then portability. Linux can run on various hardware platforms from x86 and ARM architectures to mainframes. Then community support. Due to its widespread adoption and the open source model, Linux boosts a large and active community that provides documentation, forum, tutorials, and other forms of support. So if you do not have a Linux subscription or support, you could go to the community support and ask for any issues you are having and they will be happy to help you out. Then customization. Users can choose from multiple desktop environments, window managers, and themes allowing for highly personalized experience, of course. Then the next one comes low hardware requirements. Linux can run on older hardware that might not be compatible with newer versions of Windows or Mac OS. So of course, giving life to older devices. Then the next one is multitasking. Linux support multi-users and multitasking operations right from its core. Next one is file system. Linux supports a wide range of file systems like ext4, btrfs, and xfs, and many newer file systems. Then comes the networking. Linux offers robust networking features, making it a preferred choice of servers and network management tasks. And there are many tools that are used in Linux that allows you to configure Linux networking. Then we have transparency. Users can study the source code to understand the working of the system or to ensure there aren't any unwanted features or backdoors. 
then the next one is regular updates you could get regular updates to any issues or bugs you have in the system and the last one or of course not the least one there are many more advantages so this one is less vulnerable to malware Linux security model and the smaller market share in the personal desktop segment make it less frequent target for malware compared to other operating systems. All right, these were some of the benefits of Linux, which gives its popularity in corporate world. And of course, in the end, it all depends on your application requirement and your choice. If you want to learn more about Linux, check out my best-selling course on Linux at udemy.com or you could go straight to my website utclsolutions.com and you will find the exact same course there.